Hey everybody! I'm here today to show you and tell you how to tie a bow tie using a regular tie. This will be a full tutorial, so let's get right into the video. As you can see right here, I have a regular tie, just a regular old-fashioned tie. And pretty much any tie will work for this, but ones that are a bit wider seem to work better than like skinny ties or thin ties, okay? So the first thing that you want to do is flip it upside down and just lay it out like this, okay? And you can see the point is on the left side. So I'm going to show you how to make the bow tie, then I'll show you how to use it and wear it as well. So just bear with me. I'm going to show you the whole process for doing this and it looks great at the end. So as you can see we're looking at the back side or the underside of the tie and you're going to see this little strap right here okay and what you're going to do this strap is usually used to tuck this part into it when you're done tying a regular tie but in this case we're going to get this end which is the thickest end we're going to flip it over okay and then I'm going to sort of just pinch it together like this and I'm going to tuck this underneath this strap okay you want it to be pinched because it keeps it nice and firm, firmly in place, I should say, okay? So that's the first step. And to be honest with you, that's probably the hardest, one of the hardest parts to do already. That's how easy this is to make. Now, right over here, this is gonna be one end of the bow tie. This is gonna be the other end. So you wanna take your finger, place it down here to hold this in place. And then you're gonna fold the tie over just like this. So fold that tie over just like that, okay? Just like that, that's one fold. Do the same thing the other way. This is the second fold, okay, just like that. And then the same thing the other way. This is the third fold. So three times, just like that. You wanna make sure that there's not anything sticking out over the sides of the front of the bow tie. This is the front of the bow tie that's touching the ground right now. So make sure that there's nothing sticking out from the sides. Now at this point, what we're gonna do is we're gonna create uh, a wrap around and a knot. This is probably the hardest part, but it's still really easy. So if you can do this, you're good to go. So in the middle of this third wrap right here, roughly in the middle, I'm gonna sort of place my finger there and I'm gonna fold the part that I'm gonna be wrapping. So I'm folding it in half so that the finished side of the bow tie, not the unfinished side with the seam, but the finished side of the bow tie is what we see, or the finished side of the, of the necktie is what we see. So I'm folding it in half and I'm sending it around the top, continuing to fold it, okay? Sending it around the top, just like this. And what I'm gonna do with continue, while continuing to fold it is wrap it around. So check this out, I'm folding it and I'm wrapping it around, as you can see right there, okay? And now what we're gonna do is we are gonna create uh, just a single overhand knot. So I'm gonna take this end of the tie and I'm gonna tuck it underneath this end where we bent in the last step right there. So I'm gonna tuck it underneath, check this out, and I'm gonna bring it through just like that, okay? Now we've created a knot. So what we're gonna do now, before we do anything else, we're gonna tighten up this knot. Check this out, so I'm sort of pinching the middle of the bow tie and we're tying up this knot. I'm gonna turn it around, check that out already. Let's, let's take a moment right there. Let's take a moment. Look at that, okay? It looks gorgeous, amazing, incredible. Okay, it's amazing. We just created this out of a necktie. So that's what we're gonna do to make the bow tie. As you can see, it's already done. That's how we made the bow tie. Now, to put it on, it's just one extra step. You take this right here, okay? And you just sort of wrap it around and you wanna tuck this in between the knot. So in between this top level of fabric and the one right underneath. And your knot should be pretty tight, so you wanna really, you wanna keep that knot tight. Tuck it through there, just like that, okay? Now I'm gonna show you how to put it on, okay? So I'm gonna sort of move around here. We're gonna move the camera. I'm gonna let you see myself right here. There we are, okay? So here's your bow tie. I'm gonna flip my screen out so I see what you all see. Here's your bow tie. It looks absolutely incredible so far, okay? And you can tighten the knot too if you want to make it a little bit easier, a little bit better, uh, better looking. If you wanna tighten up the knot, you can go ahead and tighten it just like that. Right, you can make it look more, even more like a bow tie. But now we have this loop right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it around my head. And you can tie the loop, like if it can't fit around your head, you can tie the loop after, you know, it's, it's around your head, right? So we have now have the bow tie like this. All that I need to do is take that end and we're gonna just tighten it up to the level that we want. And we're gonna tuck the end into our collar so we can't see it. So look at this. Just tighten it up to the level that you want it to be. Tuck this into your collar. Your collar is going to be nice and tightly up there, just like that. And what you have 
is your bow tie, just like that. And you can obviously fine tune it to make it look even better. But as you can see, we've created a bow tie from a necktie. Looks amazing in my opinion. And if you need a bow tie, you can straighten out the knot and all that. You can, you can sort of straighten everything up, make it look even better. You know, you, you can make it look like that. You can fine tune it, but that's the idea there. We've created a bow tie from a regular necktie. If you need a bow tie and you're in a situation where you don't have one, that's how you can turn a regular necktie into a bow tie. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.